video on the 230 knot sticker. And, uh, you can see I'm almost at, uh, well, I am going through 12,000, passing through plate level 120 right now. Speed is stuck on 230. And it should have switched to 293. Um, well, we'll see what happens when we get to EMAC. But for sure by IMAC, uh, it should be at 293. So we've got 18 nautical miles to get there. What's been happening is that when I get to the point where I turn off engine two from continuous to off, that speed will change. Usually it happens around 14,000 here, but uh, I've been busy video cameraing here. But anyway, here we go. Anti-ice off. No speed change. Okay. All lights off. Taxi, landing, everything off. No speed change. Okay. We're passing through 16,000 here. So now up to engine one continuous to off. No speed change. Now engine two to off and the speed just changed. So I can definitely trigger that on every flight. When I go to turn off, when I turn off engine two from continuous to off, it changes my speed from 230 to 292. And as you see, I'm not even at IMAT yet, but regardless, it should have been commanding, uh, well now it's commanding uh, decimal 6, 8. So, my speed will be increasing to reach uh, decimal 6, 8 as commanded by the FMC. So, so this is my little video, and this is my workaround for bypassing the 230 knots stick issue.